Howdy folks, Brett here. In an earlier video, I showed you the best free video editors. Many people asked what are the best video editors overall with more premium tools and higher quality features. So coming up in this top five, we'll show you the best video editing software in various categories to help you create high quality videos for any purpose. Let's get started. The first of two in this category is Adobe Premiere Elements. While it's not as feature-packed as Adobe Premiere Pro, it's a great place to start if you're a beginner looking for professional quality results. It includes a ton of cool features, including video and audio effects, face detection, transitions, and soundtracks for your videos are also included. Their website offers dozens of excellent tutorials that will help you get started, along with step-by-step -step guides. Unlike most of Adobe's software, it's available as a one-time purchase of around $100 without any reoccurring costs. If you decide to upgrade to their newest version when it's released, which is not mandatory, there is an upgrade charge. If not, you can keep using the version you paid for at no additional cost. According to Adobe's System Requirements page, Premiere Elements is available for Windows 10 and 11 and even supports Windows 7. Windows 8.1 is no longer supported. It's also available for Mac OS. The second video editor we recommend for beginners is Corel Video Studio Ultimate 2023. At the time of this recording, in late 2025, the 2023 edition is still the newest. While not as beginner-friendly as Premiere Elements, it does offer a well-designed interface that's more user-friendly than most video editing software. Some of the features include multicam editing, motion tracking, various transitions, and easy-to-use templates. It offers support for 4K Ultra HD, 360-degree VR video, and includes more than 2,000 filters and effects. There are useful audio tools included, and you can also get access to a royalty-free music library. If you need help using Video Studio, they offer a user guide, how-tos, and video tutorials on their site. Corel Video Studio Ultimate is available for Windows 8, 10, and 11. Windows 7 is no longer supported. It's available for a one-time cost of around $100, which includes a bonus collection of 33 motion graphics and animated overlays included. If you own a Mac, Apple's Final Cut Pro is the best choice for those people entrenched in the Apple ecosystem. Not only is it easy to use, it comes packed with a ton of features. Some of those features include multicam editing, HDR with advanced color grading, video noise reduction, and includes the ability to work with third-party extensions to increase its functionality. There's also support for 360-degree video editing, and you can now edit videos up to an 8K resolution. Final Cut Pro is available from the Mac App Store for around $300. While many people love the non-traditional trackless timeline, some people hate it. If Final Cut doesn't float your boat, I'll show you more video editors for Mac later in this video. If you're looking for a video editor that's the best value overall, it would be hard to beat Pinnacle Studio Ultimate. Not only is it a professional quality video editor, it also includes a screen recorder as part of its package with a one-time cost of around $100. It offers support up to 4K and 360 degree video and includes more than 2000 filters and effects. Some of its other features include motion tracking, multi-cam editing, video masks, and video overlays. Included with Studio Ultimate is access to a library of royalty-free music. It's only available for computers running Windows 10 or Windows 11. The best overall video editing software using the subscription model is Adobe Premiere Pro. It's been the industry leader for many years and is a popular choice for YouTubers, TV editors, filmmakers, and videographers. It can handle just about any file format and supports virtual reality video, HDR, and 8K footage in its native format. Some of its notable features includes dozens of transition effects, multi-cam editing, and supports an unlimited number of video tracks. The Lumetri color panel is also included for professional color grading. If you're new to Premiere Pro, on their Learn and Support page, you'll find a Getting Started Guide, Tutorials, and a User Guide. Premiere Pro is not cheap. It's available for Windows and Mac with individual plans starting at around $23 per month or you can get it as part of the Creative Cloud Pro Suite, which has jumped up in price. It used to be around $60 per month, now it's around $70 per month. 
the best overall video editing software with a one-time license fee is DaVinci Resolve Studio. For those of you that watched our roundup of the best free video editing software, you already know that we love the free version of DaVinci Resolve. And of course, their premium version is even better. The premium version of DaVinci Resolve includes just about every feature you would ever need with support for 8K editing. Their compositing software for visual effects artists called Fusion VFX is included. And Fairlight, their digital audio workstation, is also included with DaVinci Resolve. Their software is also very popular with filmmakers. A few of the notable projects include John Wick Chapter 3 Parabellum, Ad Astra, and Men in Black International. Unlike the other video editors mentioned, DaVinci Resolve Studio is available for the three major platforms, Windows, Mac, and Linux. DaVinci Resolve Studio, with all the features and tools included, along with faster video rendering, is a one-time cost of $295. They also sell hardware control panels that will give you more control editing than with a standard keyboard and mouse. If you're a video editing gangster and you've got the coin, their advanced panel will only set you back a little more than $27,000. Thanks for watching. Links are in the description. If this video helped you in finding a new video editor, give it a thumbs up and share it with others. If you use a video editor not mentioned, let us know about it in the comments. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe and make sure to click the bell to not miss out on our latest top fives and other tech related stuff here on Brett in Tech.